Welcome back, ladies and gentle memes. Frank, can you do a Larry David meme? Pretty, 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 yes, yes, I can. What's the pick here with this modern... I keep saying modern. Masters 25 draft. I like that... Oh, five minutes before you stop. Yeah, okay, that makes more sense then. Um, what's... What do you think the value is of this set when you open three of these for a $25 draft? Does that seem does that seem good to you guys? I like Bat. I like Fallen Angel. Plus, if we start singing Send Me an Angel, uh, we could actually have one to get sent. And we have Angelic Page, which is also very good. Oh, it's the niftiest of Chris's. I am ready for that modern cube. You right. You right, Noah. I think it's actually Angelic Page. I'm going to go Fallen Angel. I like black better than white, I think. Uh, but I, I don't mind black white, I guess, if you're going to pass this guy to me. Oh, the no, the foil's still here. All right, there's a foil in the pack. There are three uncommons in the pack. And there is a rare in the pack. What did they take, a murder? Like, murder's the only thing you take over, like... I guess these aren't the greatest uncommons, though. Or the greatest foil. Rare's not that great, either. Oh my god, that hands quote. With the new buy box, Legendary Healing Solve is now strictly better Lightning Helix. Wow. I don't think we're second picking Caustic Tar, that's for sure. Could just be Ruthless Ripper. I'm a big Ruthless Ripper fan, but maybe maybe I'm not. I don't like three threes for six that they just kill and then they attack you anyway. Is it just do we just try this guy out anyway? I really don't like this pack. Whatever, I took I took Darien. Hey Darien! What are you doing, Darry? Hey, Darry. I agree, Darian is a trap because it's six mana and he's a 3 3. And they just attack. They don't care about, like. They just kill him. They just don't attack you, right? Oh, uh, well, I'll just wait, I guess, until that guy's dead. Oh, I drew a removal spell. I'll kill it and now I'll attack you. I like Promise. Oh, I like Promise with Fallen Angel. Oh, I think we're black white tokensing again. Eh, I like a Nazoomer. Hopefully one of these three will come back to us. That's pretty good. Is this card good? I don't know if this card is good. I like Templar here, though. I like it better than Horror of the Broken Lands. Exile instant. Exile target instant or sorcery card from your graveyard. Okay. Cast any number of them without paying their mana costs. All right. Well, that's that's a thing. Hey, it's an almost Cathar. I wonder if Fencing Ace is actually better than I'm giving it credit for. Hmm. I don't like it as a 1-1. One -one. I like Dauntless Cathar as a, another token. Makes a 1-1 one -one floater. I like two drops, though. I don't know what to do here. Send me an angel. I'm going to take defenseless fencing ace because I... Oh, let's take an early squadron hawk. How about that? Oh, with mantle, that's pretty good. I sack like a, a land or something stupid. The Dominaria's trailer is out? There's a Dominaria trailer? What do we need that for? Just show, show me the cards. A 
three aces and three mantles. That's what I always say. That doesn't make any sense. It's not even a thing to say. I like Death's Head Buzzard, but I like it more when it doesn't kill everything we have in our deck, like all of these. I think it might just be Heavy Arbalest, because we have a lot of guys, and this is a nice piece of removal to uh, shoot the dudes. Dominaria Trailer is sick. Wow. Oh, wow, this bat came back? Ninth pick bat? Caustic Tar came back. I'll take that. Eh, we'll take the Valor. I don't know if we're going to play it, but we'll take it. I don't think any of our other cards came back. I like a Disenchant a lot. That's sad. Wow, double presence of Gond? All right. Thanos is in the Dominator trailer along with Spider Boy and Bat Dude and Tim Hardy as Poison. I have no idea what you just said right now. That's amazing. I really wish that, uh, oh my god, how many Blue Sun Zeniths can we open up as opposed to, I don't know, Jace the Mind Sculptors? The answer is three to a, to zero. That's the that's the answer. I like Geist over Undead Gladiator. It's got float. I wish we had an untapping guy in black white. But alas, we don't. Chupacabra. That's good. All right, so again, we have three foils, a fo or three three uncommons, a foil, and a rare. So again, someone took something better than Chupacabra. They're obviously not black. That's good. Hopefully this bat comes back again. Uh, never passing a Chupacabra, though, if we're in a... If we're in black. I like this guy. I like Supernatural Stamina and both cl and Cloud Shift. What's better here, though? I think they might be similar. Stamina might be better because it gives you a pump. They kind of do the same thing, right? Is that better than Dusk Legion Zealot? Probably. I like having a stamina. I'm never sad if I don't have a Dusk Legion Zealot. I like Act better now that we have Heavy Arbalist, too, because we can untap our thing. I also don't hate Savannah Lions. Why do we never get more than one Squadron Hawk? What up, LaFoaf? What up, turn one blood moon? I'm going to take the act, the act here. Oh, another bat. All right, I'll take a bat. I was going to take Oromancer, but I don't think it's Oromancer. Like, we don't have any... We have just Promise. I don't know if we're playing the Valor. I will play the bat, though. I mean, we could also take Supernatural Stamina and hope for end of the battlefield abilities, right? Nothing great here, unfortunately. Second Valor, I don't think we're playing the first. I don't care about Zoetic Cavern. Don't care about Assembly Worker. I mean, we could take Primal Clay, but like... 
I mean, the, the reason you take Primal Clay is because it blocks all the fear guys, right? But, like, we already have black cards, so I'm not really... Tara's right here. We got it over here, buddy. Oh, my God. Come on. Come on, Elk Tears. Get it together. Cavern is ramp, but it's just really expensive ramp. What does it cost to flip that thing? Like, two mana? Three mana? I was literally thinking about how it looks like it's just like flying, and then she has one other ability after flying, but that's been redacted, so. Another bat? Oh my god. Oh my god. I think I just take all the bats I can. Bat is one of my favorite creatures in this format, so. I like having a Nihil spell bomb. Again, not a big fan of Buzzard that kills all of our things. Unearth seems okay though. Squadron Hawk, you're gonna go on the sideboard until we find uh more friends for you. Sorry, pal. There was a sweat and then the epic. That is how it goes. How many bat? How many bats are they gonna give us? That's a that's a play set of bats. What's up from the draft, boys? <laughs> Oh, good times. Things are a lot calmer when Robert isn't here, but there's less honesty, right? Like, it's a less honest stream, I think. I'll just take this flash. I ain't above rare draft in a flash. I'll take a dark ritual. I'll take a cursed catcher. More like a butt catcher. Is it more like a butt catcher, though? I don't think so. Wow, look at that late crab. Sometimes you get late crabs, you know? What are you going to do? I have no idea what that Rob quote is from. I have no idea what he was trying to say there. Uh, Tar was truth yesterday. We definitely... Wow, foil rest in peace. Ooh. I mean, I'll probably take it because it's like four tickets, but I bet the foil is actually worth less. Oh, it is. It's totally less. Jesus. Oh, I'm crying out loud. It's only 250 instead of 3 370 Oh, God. Send me an angel. God, there's nothing else in this pack I would even consider taking, though. Literally nothing. It's either Skyward Eye, Dark Ritual, or Disenchant. I guess we're just taking the money. God, what a bunch of garbage, man. <gasps> oh, that's exciting. Oh, I like my red landscape as well. Hmm. I hate you guys. <laughs> Sometimes you get late crabs. 48 quotes. Wow. All right, so on turn three is the earliest we could use this. Yeah, I think it's actually just Cloud Shift. I like Dauntless Cathar better, though. I think with Daunt I think it's Dauntless Cathar. We need more early creatures. I like another Promise a lot. I also like Squadron Hawk, though.
Is it the Squadron Hawk or is it Promise number two? Squadron Hawk number two makes Squadron Hawk number one better. Frank loves mountains. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. You are awesome. Oh my god. <laughs> Why? Oh god. We took the promise. I think it's it's less likely we're gonna get a promise than another squadron hawk. I don't hate savannah lines here. Frank loves mountains. Thank you so much. You are awesome. Even your name is awesome. Um, Loyal Sentry is fine. It's not terribly exciting, but it's a guy. Savannah. <laughs> There's been a murder in Savannah. I do declare. I'll just take this living wish because whatever. Because I'm not going to take a congregate, that's why. Congregate works with our tokens if we're trying to like gain a million life. You're not wrong. But I still don't... Actually, one congregate could actually put us way ahead. It's okay, I bet it comes back and we'll be fine. Oh, another squadron hawk. God, I'm real... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Oh, my God. I'm real tempted to take this. Your voice needs to be like a thick molasses. <laughs> I love that. Oh, man. Yeah, see, uh, the thing is, Stang is not my boy. I'm going to take this squadron hawk. What is this mana war? Why are these cards so late? This is our 23 cards right now. We didn't take Trisk. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. God, what if it comes back? It can't because there's no there's no cards left in that pack. See, now I like Oromancer and we have double promise. Is there anything else we have that we can get back? No. Probably better than one Savannah Lions. That's what we're hoping for. Cloud Shift or God's Willing, I wonder. Probably Cloud Shift, right? They're both going to protect your creature from removal. One actually gets the benefit of, you know, any of these. Yeah, we'll take Cloud Shift. Oh, yes. Another Squadron Hawk. Gas. All right, we're going to move the Arbalest to the sideboard. We don't have a lot of removal, which is really sad. Probably take that loyal sentry out too. This is 17 creatures and two promises. We can probably take a dude out. Probably take one bat out, I would say. Much as I like bats. I actually think this deck looks great. My zoom is not working right now, which is really uncomfortable. Our first pick was Fallen Angel. Is there anything to put on Ace? Actually, there might not be. Maybe Fencing Ace is not great. I 
I don't hate caustic tar. I actually kind of like caustic tar. All right, let's do this. I'm game. I'm down to clown. Van Brute, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome to the Sultai Brewerski. Oh, I don't think taking out a white for double black is... I mean, we're 9-8 right now. Like, I don't think we're going to go to 8-9. It's just, I don't think that really makes that big of a difference. Nifty Chris with a three-month sub? Give me a quest. <laughs> That's a good one. That's a good jam. We're going to be rich. Give me a quest. I feel like when I was in Seattle visiting Chris, I feel like we said give me a quest like 200 times in person. For those who don't know, that's a uh, questing adventure from Hearthstone. He says, give me a quest. I don't want a squadron hawk in my dang hand. I'll still keep this hand. That's a lot of promises. You gave me promises, promises. What up, Durzo? Oh, I see. You got the green version of my guy. All right, we're going to need some lands at this point. And then we can go Promise Block. Boom. Oh, wow. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. I like that they kept the colorless man up. That's pretty good. You think Stonehill Defenders is out of my bunghole? <laughs> wow. Wow. I'm going to block and then I'm going to get four dudes. And then we're going to play another promise. And then we're going to get three more dudes. Look at all my dudes. Dude, 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 dudes. We're going to play big choops here and then we're going to be able to play uh, promise and cloud shift next turn. Put on a happy face. Blue skies are gonna clear up. Look at these dogs on dogs. Oh, that's a horror, not a dog. Oh, boy. No blocks. Get out of my dreams. Get into my car. Get out the back seat, baby. Get out of my bunghole. I mean, that's a good, that's good advice. That's just solid advice. You should get out of their bunghole. Second promise is what does you in there. All right. They could go block, block, and they take two, three, four, five. And then we make four more guys. Eh, this seemed pretty good, huh? That was a quick win. You like winning, guys? <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Wow, I like that now, uh... Yeah, we'll definitely keep this hand. I like that now there's a, uh... Quote, bunghole. That's nice. Yeah, sometimes 50 is where you hit that... <laughs> Oh my god. I can't even talk to you guys. Also, my ex-girlfriend's horse shifting state said my ego- My egos are eternal. Oh, this is a good start again. I got Billy Ocean stuck in my head. I thought this was Fencing Ace because the art looks like a creature, not a not a spell. So I was like, didn't we take this guy out? We're just going to get one here because one, who, who wants to discard? Nobody. No blocks because... Really, I want my promise to be triggering. I'm strangely proud to have contributed to quote number 50, and I would assume the first bunghole-related quote. Yeah, uh, right on both counts, actually. Promise of a... Wow, they wasted a plummet on a squadron hawk? See, so wasted like a plummet on like half of a creature. That is interesting to me. Free me. Yeah, might as well play this guy. I don't see any reason not to. Nah, I'm good. I'm good on birds. Oh, look at this. Look at this desperation. I need a land very badly. God, that's real good. Burp, 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 burp. Burp, 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 burp. Little do they know we have as many Bloodhunter bats as we do Squadron Hawks, so. Free me. More like Ambassador Smoke. 420 Blaze it, YOLO. Something like that? Oh my god. This is just this is just hilarious. Uh, I don't actually care about all your creatures. I'm gonna keep one squadron hawk back just so I can block uh like Ambassador Oak just so I can just so I can pop this bad boy. We could have killed them though. We could have put them to nine. And then that one, two, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. No, this is actually be eight. So never mind. I lied to you. I guess we can still use supernatural stamina to do it, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lethal on Boward. We can actually block with bat and then trigger it. Oh man, that seems really good though, right? Let's do that. Don't have the removal. Oh, they did it. That's so sad. That was rude. Free me. Don't have Death's Head Buzzard. Oh, just murder the other bat? Alright. You got it. 
is a lot of uh, a lot of flying guys. Six to twenty two. I feel like we're in good shape. Oh, they disconnected. That's cool. Like you do. I guess we'll see if that's uh an unintentional disconnect when they're facing down lethal or if it's like uh you know scumbag move god it's weird that the only time their internet connection seemed faulty at all was when they had lethal on board that's weird I mean you wasted a plummet on a 1-1 one, one squadron hawk like I don't really feel bad for you. <laughs> that is if you if you disconnect it on purpose anyway. If you didn't, just fine. I don't know. I have a hard time uh, giving the benefit of the doubt when the disconnect is at such a convenient time. Let's look at some of these Dominary cards while we wait. The Flame of Keld. So this is one of the new sagas, right? Uh, two mana. It's an uncommon, thankfully, because I don't think it's that good. So as this saga enters, enters and after your draw step. I like that it just says enters. It doesn't say enters the battlefield. Enters is really kind of ambiguous. As it enters and after your draw step, add a lore counter and sacrifice after three. So comes into play, it enters, so you put a lore counter on it. I assume that the first one triggers after you put a lore counter on it. So you discard your hand. Okay, comes into play, you discard your hand, right? Eh. I don't ever want to be in a position where I, this is good for me, so this is not really for me. Um, so next turn, you draw your card. Put a lore counter on it. Draw two more cards. So you're up to three cards the turn after you play this. Hopefully your hand is empty. Um, it's more like like a divination with like suspend one, you know? You're paying two to, to draw two cards in the next turn. Sure. The third one's interesting. So we've got the, the third turn after you play this. I guess the second turn after you play this, right? First turn is draw two. Third turn. Second turn after you play this is... Um, if a red source you control will deal damage to a permanent or player this turn, it deals that much damage plus two to that permanent player. So it's not really for, uh, Furnace of Wrath. It's not doubling the damage, and it's also only red sources. So if you got like a a black five five, not gonna. It's only gonna deal five. So any any red creature is gonna deal double or plus two, right? So that's interesting, especially because it only lasts for like one turn, and then it goes away forever right so that's interesting so another thing is it's hard to really set up this card you can't be like oh I have like four burn spells in hand I'm going to play this and then I'm going to burn you with them because you discard everything that you that you, that you that you would try to plan this with right like you can't have any cards in your hand you start from zero when you play this so it's really kind of interesting I mean, this is the kind of card that I think looks like hot garbage, but the abilities are so unique that it will probably find a home somewhere. Uh, and this is also a very polarizing card. You're going to have people being like, this card is, is trash, and then there's going to be people that are like, this card is really, really good. Um, so. I mean, uh, yeah, see, like, again, Bomat Courier is a really good a really good option because you can go Bomat Courier, 
and draw four cards the turn after you discard your hand and you're just like all right now i'm all set for next turn when i can burn your face for a million but it's really interesting like also madness is a thing so i mean like obviously not in standard but i mean there's lots of there's lots of hidden things that are going on with this card like discarding your hand could be good especially for cards like hazaret drawing two cards is always good um the interesting t- thing to me is that you have this tiny window where your cards are just dealing two plus damage that's interesting to me because like you could have you could literally draw like two mountains off of your off of your flame off your draw two here and then you'd be like well i have two mountains and a and a two two i can't take advantage of this ability at all and then it just goes to the graveyard the next turn which is really kind of weird so um i don't know but yeah if you look at a deck like dredge it's super interesting because like this is just a way for two mana to discard all of your hand and then the next turn you get to dredge two with it so that's cool so like that's one of the things i love about magic is because you can look at a card like this and depending on the applications it could be insanely good or it could be just terrible you never know um so how much time do we have left 259 is when they uh became a big whiny baby okay Sarah Disciple. These are just these are just from today to to explain like a little of the mechanics, I guess. Uh, flying first strike. Whenever you cast a historic spell, Sarah Disciple gets plus one plus one until end of turn. Uh, for those who don't know, historic spells are artifacts, legendaries, and sagas. So any artifact, any legendary card, and any saga card uh, are historic spells. And I guess that's going to be forever. I guess now they're just referred to as historic spells. So that's interesting. I mean, this is clearly not a constructed card. This is a limited card. You're going to play this as a 1-1 flyer with first strike. Um, You're never going to be able to trigger this. I don't think... Are there legendary instants? Do you guys know? I know there are legendary sorceries. Uh, I I don't know if there's legendary instants or not. So... But, I mean, like, being able to just... Play a 1-1 flyer for on, on turn 2 and then like play an artifact, a legendary, or a saga on turn 3 to attack for 2. Should be great. It's fine. You'll play this in limited. First strike is relevant. Flying is relevant. Keldon Overseer. Kicker Kicker is back. Uh, 3 mana for a 3-1. Kicker for 4. So you have a 3-1 haste for 3 mana. Or for 7 mana. When it enters the battlefield, it was kicked, gain control of target creature until end of turn, untap that creature, gains haste. So for seven mana, you get a 3-1 haste and an act of treason. Or a threaten. Interesting. Is that good? I don't know. You'll play it in limited, though. Guardians of Koilos. Well, somebody's got to guard those caves, I guess. Five mana for a 4-4. It's a common, so I don't have high hopes. Uh, when Guardians of Coilus enter the battlefield, you may return another target historic permanent you control to its owner's hand. So you can bounce an artifact, a legendary, or a saga to someone's hand. That's actually pretty useful because you can trigger your saga and then bounce it, get the ability again. That's pretty cool. Uh, it is Eldrazi Obligator, but Eldrazi Obligator um, only costs 5 instead of 7. Which is significantly better, as you can imagine. I guess you don't have to imagine. That's pretty, uh, you know, it's right there. All right. So not impressive, but I don't think these cards are supposed to be impressive. These are supposed to be like the limited, the limited basic stuff. That's uh, going to give you an idea of the format. This is actually perfect that our opponent disconnected here because now we get a chance to go over some of these cards. Vig- vicious offering two mana. Oh, they came back at 3.06 and then lost connection at 3.08. That's weird. <laughs> okay. Um, I wonder if they logged back in because they thought the match would be over. And then they just logged back out and they realized... Oh, now they're back again. I don't know what's going on. I'm really confused as to what's going on. All right. Hold on. Let's, let's see what we got here.
I'm pretty sure even something like Living Death wouldn't save them because you have double Bloodhunter, Bat, Squadron, Hawk in the graveyard, which puts them to like two automatically. And then actually puts them to one because of Zealot. <laughs> so even Squadron Hawk on its own would kill them at that point. Yeah, I don't know. The timing... Yeah, they just lost the game due to inaction. Like, their their timing seems a little suspect, I'll be honest. I don't know. I, I, I really want to give people the benefit of the doubt. Like, a lot. But it's hard to do. We got Pyro Nick over here. Oh, uh, yeah, this hand seems good. I'll keep it. Oh, I think the highest amount of subs I've ever had. I think I'm three subs away from that amount. Which is pretty insane to me. You guys have been awesome. Oh, that's a good that's a good thing. I think we just play Hawk now because we can block this guy if they want to get aggressive. B. Aggressive. B. B. Aggressive. Or do we not care about that? I don't know. I wanna play Cutthroat actually because it lets us keep Unearth up. I don't think we can keep Unearth up because it's a sorcery, but you guys know what I'm saying. Wow, that's so rude that you would do that to my friend. Now we get to unearth and squatter knock. All right, cool. So we're going to get both of our bros. Now we don't draw these guys, which is just great. Wow, back-to-back -back green black decks. That's pretty interesting. Well, that's a thing, I guess. Let's see the Ruthless Ripper. Oh, Diabolic Edict, huh? That's great with Squadron Hawk. Well, great for me anyway. I wish we drew a land here. I'd really, I can really go for a Bloodhunter bet. Untap my forest and Diabolic Edict you right now. It doesn't, it doesn't even make any sense. Like, by doing that, you removed any opportunity that I, that you would have for me to sacrifice the Geist, even accidentally. There's no incentive to doing it in response to me playing a better creature. Diabolic Edict number two? No. Ah, it appears the tables have turned, Mr. Pyro Nick. No, but you, I'm not saying don't do it on that turn. I'm saying definitely do it on that turn. I'm saying let this resolve first because if there's, what if I value the Squadron Hawk higher than the Geist? You don't know that. You give me the opportunity to sack either one of these because I could do it wrong. By making sure Squadron Hawk is the only one on board, you're just, you're just doing yourself a disservice. Hmm. 
Well, I think we're doing well here. I don't know. It's hard to say. Here comes Living Death. Oh, old Choopy. It's your boy, Choopy. We can put them to... We can we can deal six here, which is kind of interesting. Or, uh, yeah, a total of six, but... No. What are you doing, man? You creeping over here? Yeah. Okay. What bothers me about streamers is that they're so self-centered. They spend zero time talking about the theory of the format and stay competitive, completely focused on the play-by-play -play of their own experience. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's the worst, man. You're right. Like my 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 stupid zoom still isn't working. That's really weird. I'm really uncomfortable with it. Well, maybe if you didn't call it stupid. Uh, it wasn't working before I called it stupid. Oh. Yeah. Did you ever think about that? I didn't. Yeah. Think about that now. Give my give my drink. I didn't take it from you. Yeah. Well, you might as well have. Why? What do you mean why? Why what? Why how? Why now? Why I can't deal with him when he's like this. It's Sober Robert. <laughs> oh. Navy Bundu. I'm pretty sure Navy Bundu was kidding. I, I don't think he was being serious about the... Uh, about the streamers being self-centered. I guess we keep this slow hand. Yeah, you got a choop. Yeah, I got a choop. I got choops all day, boy. You got more than one choop? No, I just got oh. one choop. Father son stream. <laughs> oh god, it's my boy. You got a little creeping tar? Your mother's got a Cost creeping a tar. tar rather. All right, well, now I wish we had something for these three damages that we're going to be, that are going to be inflicted upon my being. Some type of way. You're some type of way. Don't play anything else. Wow, they didn't. That was really nice of them. I'm just going to kill this Morv and assume it is a uh, ruthless rippy. And it always is. We have a loyal sentry in our deck, yeah. Uh, this is my Starbucks. I needed to wake up when I get up at 3 p.m. Uh, yeah, exactly. I get real. Uh, it's so hard for me to get out of bed at, after 14 hours of sleeping. Uh, hey, man. Yeah, man? It was only 12 hours of sleeping. <sighs> <laughs> is there something wrong with you yeah hmm. you i'm wrong with you what boy are you <clears throat> pipe down buddy maybe i will maybe i won't well which is it gonna be i'll never tell Mike looks so incredible. Looks and sounds so incredibly tired. It's making me sleepy. I am Darian, King of Jeldor. Yel Yeldor or Jeldor? What do you think? Why not? No, it's definitely not Keldor. There's a J. It's got to be Jeldor. You're a Jeldor. This is a fair trade. I'll trade a bat for a perilous mirror. Because I want to get all your dudes off the board when I play Darian. Darian Rucker from from Hootie and the Blowfish. I hope they don't have a way to kill this guy. God, don't have a don't have a thing. 
This is where they just go like kill this guy and then we're just done. The J is a Y. It's it's Kieldor. Wow, how do multiple people know that? <clears throat> how do multiple people know that in the chat right now? They didn't attack. This is great news. Was the K not silent? I thought that was like a thing in a different language. You're silent. Yeah, we're just gonna put this on here. If you want to attack me for f six, I'll just take. I'll just take it. Take it for a ride. Gonna take you for a ride. Do, 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 do. You know the game that is, man? No, man. I have no idea. You That's from. It's it. from Tekken Three. It's not. That's sad. It's murder. This is why I hate. This guy's just so stupid. Like six mana for this guy that just dies to. That was a good draw, I guess. Kind of, maybe. How many squawk boys you got? I got three squawk boys. Oh dang! Oh dang! No, get both of them. Get both of them. I'm having a good user interface experience. <laughs> Gonna squawk you for a ride. I think we just play this. Uh... Oh, actually, we can play land, can't we? You could. Is that more important than three? 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 I guess it's not. I want to keep this up so I can block two dudes and then one dude. Two dudes and one dude. Yeah, we can pass here. Reet! Oh. oh, plummet. Oh, my God. I mean, we have like three bats in this deck, so that makes sense. Like, I, I don't mind a plummet. I do. I want my squawks to live. It's your squawky boy. If you, have a, if you have a removal spell, you would have just killed this guy and killed me, right? So. Um, what am I killing? Probably this guy. But maybe not. Could be this guy. Yeah, we'll just kill this guy. That seems fine. I just hope you don't hit a guy, I guess. I hope you hit something stupid like a Diabolic Eagle or something. I think Mike is dying right now. That's the second time someone plummeted my 1-1 one, one Squadron Hawk. Yes! That's exactly what we wanted, dude. That's so good. They targeted themselves? What about what? I guess it deals us two, but... Do you have to... What? That's weird. Can you just kill me now? Oh, that's really good. I guess you could get wrecked Ruthless Ripper and then this is a Ruthless Ripper and then you just double Ripper me. You got Ripper and Mirror. Alright, well, yeah, that's pretty good. That would be lethal, wouldn't it? It's not bad. It's not bad. Alright, that'll do. I guess we'll play... Oh, it's a Willy Loxodon. Interesting. Alright, I guess we're going to just play more bats or something. I wonder if we like rest in peace here. They have Bayloth Null and Unearth. We can just take out Unearth and put Rest in Peace in here. Uh, whenever this creature dies, return to the battlefield tapped under its owner's control. So that actually doesn't work either. Is Rest in Peace good enough? I guess we can put Spellbomb in instead. Spellbomb's probably just better, right? It says draw a card, so. Yeah, I agree. You say draw a card. That's, that's a pretty good hand. Hold up, LaFoaf. Got my hawks for days, boy. What you know about them hawks? 
I know they like to squawk. Do you? Yeah. Do you? What's up, what's up, what's up? What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Big Conic! <laughs> oh, that's a good meme. Oh, boy. Do it. You got to plummet. You got to plummet right now, even though it does nothing. Sure. You got it. This hand seems unbeatable right now, but what do I know? Could be a Loxodon, could be a Ripper. Big Gonek! Is that all that guy's worth to use a cycle? Yeah. Wow. Get out of my face, cycle man. Your opponent didn't want none from Promise of Buns, hun. Yeah, that's true. That's from uh, Sir Mixalot. This is true. I know. Really? This is aggressive. I'll block. Oh, he can't block. This guy can't block. I literally never remember this guy can't block. Maybe one day you will. One day. Well, that's annoying. I wonder if I just attack and then act. Attack and then act a fool. I just this thing back doesn't do anything. I think I do I just bat? What are they? Three, four, five? If we play a bat, we can block here. Make a bunch of one worms. I don't think we attack. I think we just wait. What? Jalapeno Children's Fund, 566. Please, won't somebody think of the spicy little ones? Wow. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, oh, my God. Boy. I really hope they do. Sometimes Frank likes my constant song references. Sometimes I get a song stuck in his head and he hates me. Such is life. It's really... Yeah, it's really just the, the pendulum swinging there, my friend. Look at all these floats. There are several. There are several. Wow. How come when you have a foil squadron hawk, it doesn't get all foil squadron hawks? You know, I don't know. Can you can you find out? Look, the zoom works here. It just doesn't work in the deck building screen. That's weird. I might know a guy. You know a guy? Yeah. What's his Help name? You with your foils. I think is the coaster under these. Oh. No. Oh that. yeah, there's one. Cool. Knock yourself out. You're a magic trick. No, I'm, I'm serious. Knock yourself out. I don't think I can. I'll help you if I you need. I have my trusty pipe. Your pipe? Yeah. Do you, do you smoke yourself out? Yeah, man. I get super lit. <laughs> All right. That's cool. You know, you do what you got to do, I guess. I'll just double block here. If I can if I can kill this one morph with two one ones, that's totally fine. It was a woolly a woolly crapsodon. Oh, big choops. A big connect. I like that we have such good diabolic edict protection right now with these multiple spirits. Yeah, you, yeah, cycle that dude. Spirutas. God. This is a cheap world. I'm just living in it. 
Oh, no attacks, huh? All right. Don't believe me, just watch. God, pernicious dude, you're so good at it. It's unbelievable, man. I'm just gonna pass here. I wish these spirits had float. I also wish they didn't have weird spiral faces because that's uncomfortable. What's wrong with a spiral face? I mean, since you grew up with a spiral face, I, I imagine you understand why. Yeah. Uh, or why you don't have a problem with it, but... Strionic Resonator is interesting. Be some kind of spiral face? I don't want to say it, but yeah. Wow. I hate your kind. That's, that's very rude. You're very rude. So they go block here, and they take four. That's not great. I'll just take... I'll just deal you the two. That's so funny to me. It's murder. So now I actually kind of want to kill this guy because you can't resonate it. Because that's a triggered ability um, that uh, I'd rather you not have. What's it going to be? Oh no, it's a mesmeric fiend. Ooh. See you later, act. Yeah, whatever. Sure. That's pretty good. Really? I don't think that does anything. Five five that's pro white. Oh, tell me more. Shoot, I got squadron hawks on deck, boy. You have one on deck. It's on the deck, is it not? Don't believe me, just watch, okay? Thank you for streaming MM25, Dino Watch It, and no one else is doing really? No one else is streaming Masters twenty five? That's weird. Hmm. Also, I don't know what the two M's are for, Dan. That's that's one too many M's. Mr. Master 25. I'm just going to take five here. They have one card. Oh, this is good news. That was a good draw. It was decent. It was good. Well, good and decent are pretty similar, so. So two, three, four, five, six, seven... Interesting. Wow. Give me them crads, boy. And I get four one ones out of this deal? I'll sack a one one. That was what you drew? Oh, that's great. Wow, that's real good. So you're dead on board now. That's good. Have you seen the Conjurers are Fire Song and Sunspeaker? I don't think so. I don't have a legendary creature still. So you block two, you take four, five, six. Darn it. How you doing over there? Oh boy. Okay. We're doing good. This is my loyal sentry. There are many like it, but this one is mine. Do we just Nihil spell while I'm trying to win? Seems okay. Actually, I think they have to have they have to have draw two guys next turn. Or a guy or they have to they have to have two things next turn, because they go to six. Uh and we have five, six, seven guys and an extra two damage in hand. So they're essentially at four. And we have seven things. So they either have to have... Even if they have one creature, they still take four plus two. So not really necessary here. Go. 
God, here we go. I just literally heard Felipe ask Google who is the Scranton Strangler. That's hilarious. Yeah, I to heard me. that too. Yeah, this is perfect. This is exactly what we're waiting for, so. Pretty good draw. Well, they're dead. They block three, they take four and two. They know we have act, so. And they have zero cards in hand, so yeah, they are dead. Yeah. And oh, that's good too. That's the game, boys. If you don't believe me, Mike, just watch. Okay, I'm watching. Don't believe me, just watch. All right, one more. So the new legendary Red Wing Minion is only available. Yeah, of course. It's standard, it's standard legal and going to have huge commander demand, but no supply. Oh, that isn't. I mean, yeah, I didn't know it was standard legal. That's weird that there's a standard legal card that's only available as a buy box promo. It's like breaking all the rules. It is breaking all the rules. <laughs> What a heroic shit hawk. You ain't wrong. I'll keep this hand. Seems decent. As long as we can draw that promise of Boon Rai before we can draw this Oromancer, that's pretty good. If you don't believe me, Mike, just watch. Oh. I said just watch. Never. I think we're actually going to cycle that that bad Larry. What makes his Larry bad? Uh, he doesn't have his own Larry. He is a Larry. Uh oh. Are you a Larry? Every day I'm Larrying. That's good. What are you going to do about it? I'll don't believe you. I'll don't believe you. Just watch. I'll don't believe you. Just watch. Michael Bartholomew, 2018. Do 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 ah. Be do 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 do. I wish they arcane denied that so I could draw two cards from it. I also don't think this this six mana sun cow is gonna really have a, a huge impact on standard, so that's not a huge concern to me. What does it do? My God. I mean, just for six mana, like. Oh, yeah. Seems pretty cool in Commander. You seem pretty cool in Commander. Thank you. Not. Are they going to Mystic Snake this? Oh, man, I'm so proud of you. God, that's so good. God, I'm, I'm so proud. Should have just passed and been like, all right, you can have it, man. If you don't want, to, if you want to waste your turn, oof, that's expensive. You sifty. Come on, get sifty. It's only game. It's only game. I highly doubt the turn to phase out, Commander. That seems. That's actually a pretty pretty ridiculous accusation. Although a standard commander would be interesting. Your mother's a standard commander. Is she? Yeah, boy. Hmm. Here we go. 
Here we go. How much mana are you adding? Six mana? God, what is this? Frost Titan? Oh, that's cool. Not as bad as Frost Titan. You're not as bad as Frost Titan. I don't know whether to thank you or not. You'll you'll know one day. One, one day. day there it is. I'm just putting this on here now that I have a chance. No attackerinos. I'll take it. No blocks for me, my friend. Just pass the turn. Don't be playing those seven mana guys. Oh my oh my god. It's a big old dinosaur. I'm a big old dinosaur. Don't believe me, just watch. Just take your two. You just take two here. Look how sneaky I am. Just take your two damage. There you go, you figured it out. You got it. God, I still have five cards in their hand. I guess we're take 10 here. <laughs> it's not good. Yikes. Have you ever seen or heard any of uh, Brisgalov's other interviews? I have not, actually. I have not. <sighs> Maybe I just chump block here and then Supreme, and then they go to 10. We can attack for a lot next turn. Like, we put them to six with this, right? But then we put them to four? I actually think it's fine. A morve. Another morve. Two morves. Two morves are better than one. You know, will bender this? No, oh, sure. How convenient. Well, that changes things. No cream or milk for your coffee? Dang, that's rough. <clears throat> So we gotta go block here, block here. We take four, five. I think we're, I think we're dead. I think we're priced into blocking or or just alphaing here and see what happens. One, two, three, four, four. We can deal six. That's pretty bad. Could also get this guy back and then get Caustic Tar back. That seems also bad. Actually, we're, we survive because Loyal Sentry just blocks this before damage. That's actually really good. Literally, because the coffee has no milk, so it's worthless. Wow. <laughs> wow, that's... <laughs> 
Just literally pour it on the ground because it's garbage. This is actually very good. And we can block here and we only go to one. I don't know how we came back from this if we did, but we got a chance. This is the sweat and then the epic. I'm waiting for the epic, man. I just got something stupid. It's going to be a totally, totally absent. Just bounce this guy. Totally, totally lost. They're just slow rolling. It was totally lost. Yeah, that took you way longer than it needed to. That's cool. Just sure. And decree would have been good. Did totally lost that game. Do 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 ah. Still can't zoom in on here. This is really weird. I wish we had more ways to deal with big idiots. Like we only have ravenous chupacabra. Got to save that chup. It's like an investment. Apparently you do. Keep. Should have used the sink in hindsight. Why was mad at the coffee on the floor? Oh God. I'll be back. Where are you going? You gotta take some, a little boop. Get some water. He's gonna take a little boop. Let's minimize the odds of ever drawing these by putting them all in our hand right now. Yeah, I just don't care about uh, zooming that much that I want to restart. Oh man, this is like, this is our deck from yesterday, only a better version of it, so... Like, they have, like, two or three cards, and, they, and the, one of them has to be totally lost. So, I guess that's cool. Uh, my age does not matter, I don't think. I'm sorry, that's just a question I get asked a lot, and I don't think it's ever relevant. So, it's just a weird... It's weird to get asked that. I think I got more defensive about that than I should have, so I apologize for that. It's just a weird question that everyone asks me, and I don't know... Like, it's frustrating. Sorry, Big Scary Dave. <laughs> 38, not correct. Uh, bat it up. I had an older age and wondering for similar ages. Man, see, that makes me feel old. Super old, Dave. Super old, Dave. God. Unbelievable. Yeah, this long scale coaddle is getting out of hand. It's weird that you use this when you don't have to. Sure. Yep, this is why we can never 3-0 a draft. Because <laughs> of nonsense like this. You win? No. Of course we didn't win. <laughs>
Uh, I guess we'll chump block. Don't believe me, just block. got a lot of unblockable dudes. Make one unblockable. I think we're just dead now because we take a million here. Which sucks because if we had two more life, we could probably survive. We can take six, seven, eight, nine. If we're with ten, we survive. But now they just like literally have exactly five to activate this literal guy. Yep, all right. Another frustrating 2-1. What can you do? Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Uh, if you guys haven't done so, slam those like and subscribe buttons as usual. There's new content every day on YouTube at uh, 11 a.m. And I'm trying it out at 11 p.m. Eastern time as well. So two videos a day. Um, yeah, well, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.